The only time many Americans hear about the U.S. Coast Guard is during a major disaster for highly publicized search and rescue. Harvey pounded the Texas shoreline today. The Coast Guard pulled off a number of dramatic rescues. Our Anderson Cooper also is in the sky. He's with the Coast Guard. They're trying to decide where they're going to drop off these two people. There's a shelter nearby. Members of the Coast Guard have flown in from around the country. Rescue swimmer Graham McGinnis and his team helped save a family of three on Sunday. We have other people stranded in vehicles. And they are risking their lives to save lives. It seems like it's been relentless for you. I mean, it was Harvey, it's now Irma. This dramatic rescue to show you off the coast of Puerto Rico tonight, the U.S. Coast Guard. A woman and her two 12-year-old kids standing on top of an upside-down boat. Like Coast Guard Petty Officer Ashley Leppard. Ashley, we all thank you. Thank you very much. So you heard about the Coast Guard this year. But what you might not know is that despite massive response and recovery efforts, critical work continued around the globe. Crews defended U.S. maritime borders in record-setting fashion, keeping nearly $7 billion out of the hands of vicious transnational criminal organizations. The Inland Waterways Fleet safeguarded America's economic security, keeping shipping lanes open for more than four and a half trillion dollars worth of economic activity and working to quickly reopen ports damaged by the hurricanes. Cutter Healy projected sovereignty in the Arctic and the nation's one and only heavy icebreaker, the Polar Star, set sail for Antarctica to ensure access and protect key national interests. Americans trusted no matter the demand, no matter the mission, the Coast Guard would meet the call. Whether the task was less glamorous, like growing the cyber program, achieving a fifth consecutive clean financial audit, or continuing to deliver new cutters on time and on budget. Or whether in the national spotlight, the public the Coast Guard serves trust the nation's smallest armed force to do one specific thing. Get it done.